President of the General Assembly, Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, it is particularly significant for me to take part in this summit of the future because I have received my current mandate of the Prime Minister of the Republic of Armenia in the parliamentary elections under the slogan of our party, there is a future. All the problems we are facing today are directly or indirectly related to the decisions made or haven't been made at some point in the past. And the same we can say about all the successes and achievements of today. We cannot change the past. We cannot change a lot even today because today is to some extent a part of the past. But shaping the future is today's most important task. The agenda of our actions is also known. Peace, security, prosperity, freedom, justice, human rights, artificial intelligence, climate change. But what is of high importance is the concept that we should put in the basis of our vision of the future and consequently how to build the future. It may sound strange, but the most important thing we can do for the future is to create positive narratives and focus on the possibilities of creating the foundations for them, regardless of whether they exist at the moment or not. One of the reasons for today's global crisis is that international formats have long become an arena for mutual accusations, threats, and the places where crises and deadlocks take place or being announced. I can hardly remember a positive speech on behalf either of myself or other leaders on international platforms and there are objective reasons for this. There is little material for positive discourse, and maybe it's because in the past there was very little or there was no any positive narrative at all. We usually come to UN to declare how bad it is going to be, because the facts proving this are a lot and everywhere. So it doesn't require much effort to see them. Efforts should be made to see the prerequisite of a good future and think about them because what happens in reality first happens in our minds. My party adopted the slogan, there is a future, under the conditions when it seemed that there was no hope for optimists in our region. Now this happens globally. And at the summit of the future, I want to voice that belief of there is a future. And by doing this, I want to have my portion of contribution. Unlike the previous three times this year at the General Assembly, I will more concentrate on op opportunities rather than accusing neighboring countries in my speech. And this will provide room for positive thinking and for talking about the possibilities. Yes, for now, let's only talk, since in the beginning was the word, and the word was with God, and the word was God. Therefore, it is necessary to start with the good, good words. It is necessary to bring forward the slogan, there is a future, as a theorem, and to work to prove it. Let's do it. Thank you for your attention. Thank the Prime Minister of the Republic of Armenia.